guys, Chris here with Super Savvy Travelers. Hey, today I thought we'd take a break from all the property, property, property stuff and uh, talk about something, a subject near and dear to my heart, a subject that I study close up and personal every single day if I can. It's the subject of gelato, specifically gelato versus ice cream and why we love gelato so much better and it's so much better for you. So I have some stats here. I went to mm, spruceeats.com and I got some data here. First of all, um, gelato has a lot less fat. It's made with less cream and more milk, and there's no egg yolks in it. So there's a lot less fat in gelato than ice cream. But that's only kind of where the, the differences begin because, in fact, it has a whole lot less air than ice cream because it's churned at a lower rate. And since it's so light to begin with and has less fat, it has this really silky smooth texture. That and it's generally kept and served at a slightly higher temperature. So instead of freezing your tongue and waiting for that giant block of ice cream to melt, the gelato is just ready to go right at the right temperature. It just melts in your mouth and it's just so good. Now, calorie wise, um, you can save a lot by eating gelato. Now, Spruce Eats talks about um, the calories in half a cup of ice cream. And if you've watched Brian Reagan at all, you can understand um, his take on a half a cup of ice cream not being a full serving size, which is absolutely correct. And nobody does eat half a cup of ice cream. So um, basically do the multiplication tables as you will on this, because from what I'm seeing, uh, it's like when you, you go someplace and everything's on sale, the more you buy, the more you save. Well, hi guys, I corrected Chris here. I totally messed up the calories on the ice cream versus gelato. So um, let me clarify. One half cup of ice cream is 145 calories. One half cup of gelato is about 124 calories. So um, you can see how if you ate enough gelato, you could really save on calories. Anyway, wanted to put that in before I got too much uh, off in the weeds here on that thing. So uh, here we go. That. So um, having talked about gelato, I'm like really wanting one. So I'm gonna go up there. I'm gonna show you what we've got up there at the, the bar Akiatsa with Antonio who makes his own gelato. And I'm gonna show you the flavors and I'm gonna show you close up and personal exactly what a great gelato looks like. Okay, so we have Gertz's daughter here. And, uh, and she is our gelato captain for the day. So we're gonna look and see what we've got. We've got yogurt back there. Uh, pistachio, Nutella, vanilla. Ooh, I like Kinder Bueno. That's a good one. Um, okay, um, Kinder Bueno and what else? What else? Um, cheesecake. Now the cheesecake you can see is almost gone because it's like the best. It's cheesecake and um, yummy crunchies. It's really, really good. So I'm getting a medium cup. Usually I get a cone, but uh, today I, I need both hands, so I'm going to do that. And I'm buying my friend Giuseppe an ice cream too, so he's going to choose as well. So you can see that these flavors are really nice. They can put whatever they want in there. Amarena is like sour cherry. It's so good. Oh my goodness. So we're going to enjoy that. Guys, check it out. This is the cheesecake section. You can see that um, gelato served warmer actually melts quicker, so you gotta eat it faster, which is always a lot of fun. There's the cheesecake, there's my cookies. And I'm just gonna get started, because it's so good. Okay, well that was delicious. I'm gonna go see what Casa Cristina looks like.